Follow me to Pottery Class at Sanaa Studios. It's in Barbican, Kingston, and they had a wheel throwing experience for 5,500 Jamaican dollars. So it's a two hour class. Just call them to register for the course and they'll send you a link and you follow the instructions to make sure that you're registered. So this is me just waiting on the class to start. They start off with a demonstration and then you get your turn around the wheel. Notice I have the water pan and the sponge, the clay. So I think a lot of people starting out, it will feel like you're out of control, never feel out of control. And you push it down, keep doing it down. Back in. So we're not just like doing this, right? We're really... So I went with my friends and they just play music and you wait and then you go in pairs. So, yeah. <laughs> so make sure that you guys wear clothes that you don't really care about if it gets clay on i think the clay can wash out but i never take no risk and also put your hair back so that it doesn't fall into your face or into the clay my braids fell into my clay a few times and um i was gonna take them out the next day anyway that's why i have a bandana time in my head up anyway so it never really bothered me much but if yeah you'll be washing clay out here it's not going to always come out so just make sure you're tight like good that it's not falling into the clay and they're very hands-on like they will help you even though you had the demonstration they will help you throughout the process of making yours i remember you and somebody else doing it at the same time so they go back and forth between the both of you um, if you're having really hard time, you could pause for a little bit until they see that you need some more help. But just kind of follow what they said and it will work out. Putting the hands here. So this is them just helping me get the clay off the wheel and then it's gonna dry in the studio for a few weeks and then they're, so, they're gonna call you if they don't call you check in with them and see if they've fired your piece already so that you can come and pick it up because um some of them may not fire so well and may get damaged or destroyed while being fired that's just part of the pottery process but if it's not then you can pick it up Afterwards, me and my friends went to Chive because it was nearby and I ordered a mac and cheese with no meat. It came with a salad and I ordered seasoned fries to go with it. Would you believe the salad tastes better than the mac and cheese and the seasoned fries are the best thing to eat? Well, yeah, I've had their mac and cheese before and it had chicken on it. I ordered it with chicken and it was barbecue chicken and I don't know about anybody else, but I hate saucy chicken with mac and cheese. Yeah, it bothered me. Some ladies came in asking if it tasted good and I couldn't lie to them. So I told them it now in a flavor, it bland. And they were starting to get worried about their experience. And then they ordered some soup and the, the lady that was idea was to be there didn't seem like she enjoyed the food at all. She was kind of sad because she invited her friend and she enjoys the place normally. But yeah, my friends had a chive burger and they liked it. Um, The mac and cheese is not it, it now in a flavor. It's like... So around this time, I also reached a thousand subscribers on YouTube. Yay. So thank you guys for all the support as usual. If you guys don't know my channel, it's it's Kashima, same as here. And yeah, we reached a thousand subscribers on YouTube. So this is me with a mudslide waiting on my friends to arrive at South Avenue Grill because I planned a birthday party for her there. This is the soup. I loved it. It had a lot of beef and a lot of pig still in there. Somebody else got the soup with me at the same time. Theirs didn't have as many. So I think they put all of it in my bowl. And then this is the lip gloss combo I had for the day. This is Fuchsia Flex by Fenty. Then the entrees came and this person got the Cajun bourbon chicken. They said it was uh, too sweet for them and they didn't really enjoy it. This is the jalapeno burger and this is the jerk burger. The jalapeno burger, they didn't really enjoy it. They didn't think it was spicy. The jerk burger, they thought was better than a jalapeno burger, but... This is my filet mignon with the peppercorn sauce. So I got it. You guys see them? Two little bit of vegetable. Wow. Wow. Look at it. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. So it was good though. I like this meal. It was well salt and peppered. Yeah. So this is me just reapplying the lip combo. As a matter of fact, I'm changing it a bit. So I'm applying Fenty Fruit Snacks first. This is in the cream formula. I'm applying a thin layer of fruit snacks. And then I'm going to go in with the future flex on top 
fruit snacks is like a red berry color so like it gives that depth to the fuchsia flakes so i can put like a layer of color underneath making it pop more so this is so it looks a lot more pinker a lot more richer after i do the combo so i prefer this combo if you want it to be noticeable but it's still glasses so like you eat and it's gonna come off but if you're just gonna be talking or drinking it's a good lip combo <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Woo! May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you. May the good Lord bless you. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Thank you. Yay! So guys, what you know, I ordered a cake from Sugar and Spice couple days in advance as per their requirement i think it was three days in that two um or one and the kit dry 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 the part that left actually moister than the part we were eating at the restaurant and everybody has put up the cake because she don't want to carry over a dry cake right it dry man it dry bad this is the same day i picked it up um, I picked it up right before I went to the restaurant. It dry bad, dry bad. Crumble everywhere. Fuck, could I barely lift up the cake to eat with it? It was sad, sad bad. I've never had a sugar and spice cake like that. It lit me for six. It lit me for six, man. I didn't very much want to go back down. They got tell him. But used to become a macaroon butter, like macaroon butter. Then I went to the European Union Jamaica 5K run. It's a 10K this year, but I went last year and this year and my specs are about the same like i literally went gym like two 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 weeks before this just so many drop down like just so many drop down but every year i go old people beat me and ask for something man yeah man but at least me get the medal as long as me get the medal me all right so this was the first year medal the one that i was showing first is the second year medal so they look a little bit different it's the same medal but the finishing are different but as usual, guys, that's it. So you know what it is. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You know what it is. It's Kashima. Bye.